And now for some Israeli pride, Zenith Solar, an Israeli startup company working on revolutionary solar energy technologies, launched its first solar farm in a ceremony attended by Israel's President Shimon Peres. Developed by Professor David Feynman from the Ben Gurion University, the system will harvest more than 70% of incoming solar energy. This compared to industry norms of 10% to 40%. Here's a look at this important Israeli development. We are here in, the, in this first uh, commercial installation, which uh, um, in this specific field we're going to have 32 modules, uh, which is uh, initially based on, on the concentrated technology developed by Professor Feynman. It's uh, David, among uh, maybe uh, one or two other scientists in the world, uh, one maybe American and one Spanish, is, uh, is uh, promoting for CPV for the past 10 years. All of the research, was, uh, the initial research, was done at Ben Gurion University at the Blaustein Institute using the big dish that we built with funding from the Sector Rashi Foundation and the Israel Ministry of National Infrastructure. And this particular concentrated photovoltaics project uh, was funded by a European research grant with partners from various parts of Europe. This field is um, be finalized by the end of uh, April. We're going to cut the ribbon. And I don't know if you can see on the back of me, there is a storage tank here, which is going to accumulate and store hot water, thermal hot water, that is, uh, would be supplied to the centralized water system of the kibbutz here. We do hope that this is a starting point uh, with this uh, specific application that later on would be adapted to small cities and even large cities later on, not only in Israel. Of course, we need the light, we need the sun. So um, what would not uh, be, it's not to, it would be a good idea to go to northern part of uh, Europe, but uh, in most parts of America, in the Sunbelt areas, this uh, technology would be highly economical. <music> 